Hello Ice Cream Dream Team fans, welcome back. Um, we just had a very interesting experience. We were so excited to tell you about it. This was at Dream Cone in Harrisonburg, Virginia. And, okay, so let me just describe our experience. We walk in and you're walking in and there's music playing, like really nice Frank Sinatra music. Except on the walls are pictures of tattoos you could get at this place. So yes, then you walk in and you walk past what looks kind of like an artist studio with fake geodes on the wall made out of molded glass. And then you have um, etched glass in shapes, which we will be posting pictures later, just FYI. Um, and you walk in, the ice cream is kept in the back. We turned around and saw a man walking in with a broom with a dog in his apron pocket. And there weren't just, there wasn't just one dog in the area. There were two um, kept in the back. One was named Bernadette. <laughs> but that was a very interesting dog name. Um, yeah, anyway. the whole freezer in the back. He's like, oh, the ice cream, or the freezer, or the ice cream's in the back today. I was like, hmm. So we have a uh, uh, triple chocolate scoop, uh, price. Three hundred six three dollars and sixty five cents. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. triple chocolate peanut butter. Triple right? chocolate peanut butter. Yes. Yes. And I was laughing because three hundred sixty five. You know, number of days in the year. I should be having ice cream three hundred sixty five days a year. So Amen. I'm gonna go ahead and test it. It smelled very chocolatey and good. Mm. That was really good. Very chocolatey. Ice cream wasn't bad. I think what, like. It outstands me the most is the whole atmosphere Experience. that was yeah. there there's a really sweet mom and dad that are there they're like mom and pop kind of thing um and they are adorable so now i will let nat take over all right i got triple chocolate peanut butter too never had this flavor before anywhere so Ooh, yeah it's really good definitely triple chocolate very good um, I'm still just like, what, what happened? Because we were walking up to the place and this man was sitting there with his dog in his lap. And then Tori and I are kind of dancing going into the music. And then I see the guy get up and follow him. I was like, wait, why is he following us? But then I guess it was the owner. So, yeah. It was very strange. However, I am pleasantly surprised by the ice cream. Mm -hmm. And here we have Jay-Z, and he decided to get a root beer float. Again. <laughs> Again, yes. Any comments? Um, ice cream definitely not bad. Um, I mean, I'd say the vanilla is pretty much your generic vanilla. Um, have I you was... had a root beer float with chocolate like they offered you? Mm -hmm. Okay. But I have, I have, I well, no, actually I have. I've made a homemade one, but never at a place. It's not okay. very good. Okay. Um. Say, yeah, the atmosphere. You're oh, strong. The spoon. Oh, yeah, yeah, tell them about the spoon. <laughs> so they asked me what color I'd like for a spoon, and the spoon is also it's a spoon and a straw at the same time. What? Okay, I was which wondering. Which is actually kind of cool. That yeah. is very clever for a root beer float. All right, that gets them some brownie. That gets some points. That's yeah. pretty sick. Okay. But definitely a very interesting experience. Not sure if I go back or not. I think I, I would take people just so they experience it. Exactly. <laughs> it's, it's definitely something you have to experience. Um, I give the ice cream an average score of five, I guess. Maybe four Ooh, or five. Got a good chunk. You just got a good chunk. All right, so what would you give the ice cream? After that chunk, I'd say a six. All <laughs> right. The atmosphere, I, like... It did not really have any place to sit, which is why we are currently it didn't, not on one place. the courthouse steps here in Harrisonburg. Um, <laughs> so I, I gotta say atmosphere just because it was so interesting though, I give it a seven. Cause it was crazy and they were really sweet and really polite. Um, customer service, again, they were really sweet and really polite, but it did take a while for us to get our ice cream. Um, so I think customer service, I gotta give them a five as well. You know, what are you guys thinking? I would think seven. Or, I mean, the only thing was time for me. Time? Mm -hmm. I'll give it seven. Seven? Okay. Um, but yeah, so that is this week's episode of, or I shouldn't even say this week, because we're getting ice cream more than once a week at this point. <laughs> um, 
Feel That's it for to. this episode of Ice Cream Dream Team. Um, again, weird experience. Definitely go there just to get it yeah. um, and see it and hear what we're talking about. So, again, that was Dream Cones um, on Main Street in Harrisonburg. So, awesome. All right, bye, everybody. Bye. 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 Look, clock tower. Good timing. <laughs>